Pisces, welcome to the Onyx Moon Tarot. Like, share, subscribe, comment. I'm using True Emotional Oracle for your Oracle card message and Pump Pulp Tarot for your tarot card reading. Pisces, there's no gender in tarot. This is something that could have happened to you already, could be happening to you now, could happen to you in the future. I'm pulling on your sun sign of Pisces. Check your other placements. This is a collective reading, meaning energy can flip. I'm pulling for a lot of Pisces. It may not resonate. If it doesn't resonate, you can negate the reading. I don't have a problem with that. I could be pulling for cross watcher energy too if it doesn't resonate. If it does resonate, give me a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button. YouTube has taken 70 subscribers away from me. I don't know why. I woke up and 70 were gone. I don't sugarcoat anything, my titles or my readings. If it makes sense, let me know. I like to know if I've hit my mark. Shady. Somebody shady. Hmm. Somebody shady. the truth and nothing but the truth standing in power curbing those primal urges to bite somebody's head off healing mentally physically emotionally and spiritually not pre empress falling short of being pre empress not wish fulfillment. Completely finished. Finito. Over. Top four at your job. All right, want the truth, nothing but the truth. Archangel Michael's sort of truth. Next to Leo energy, strength, inner strength, inner intestinal fortitude, needing to heal, knowing that you need to heal mentally, physically, emotionally, spiritually, taking that time out to revive after not having wish fulfillment, needing wish fulfillment, but not receiving wish fulfillment. Somebody may drink a lot after an ending, a, t a total ending, annihilation, finished, everything is over. There is no hope of a reconciliation or of anything coming back together. It's completely done. Concentrating on the money because there is nothing else to look forward to got to concentrate on something so we're throwing all of the energy into finances there's no there's no harvest to be reaped in anything else so money is our focus queen of cups showing up as the queen of cups though nurturing loving intuitive unconditional love can be a little moody There's somebody, Aquarian energy, I have Aquarian energy both. Lying, cheating, betraying, head over heart decisions, emotionless, harsh, making a decision. Feeling left out in the cold. Wanting, someone's wanting to bring it back together, but this is over. 
this is not a reconciliation. This is not a reawakening. You have no thought in your mind to bring anything back to life. It is dead to you. Will not be a friend, will not be a co-worker, will not be a teammate, third party situation, have absolutely no desire to embroil yourself into something like this and will not revive or reawaken anything, not friendship, not work relationship, not lovers, nothing. You do not associate, wish anyone well, nothing that has put you in a third party situation. And I'm going to leave your reading there because that's the end. You, you have spoken. The great Oz has spoken and it's pretty much done. The fact that you are standing in your strength and you pretty much made your point clear. They're not your wish fulfillment. You have no harvest to reap from this person and it is dead. Anybody that has betrayed you, you have nothing to do with them. Not even wishing them well. Pisces, this is your reading. Give me a thumbs up if it resonates with you. Subscribe if it resonates with you since YouTube decided to steal 70 of my subscribers. And come back and see me next week.